Hello YouTube, welcome back, it's Caveman Bagnall and we're playing some Starfield. Well we left it last time where we um, we went in search of Moira for some more artifacts and upon there we came across a base that was full of spacers and, and raiders. We managed to get through that but we still haven't found Moira so it looks like he was setting up a trap and now the quest continues in the soul system where earth is and i think we've got to go to neptune next but i did notice at the end of last episode it did come up with a pop-up to state we were over encumbered so i just need to quickly sort that out so let's get into our inventory let's definitely put our resources over there and then we've got quite a bit of stuff that we're not utilising at the moment. So I think I'm just going to dump all this in here for now. And the view will be when we get to a city of some sort. We can sell it. That's took our mass right down. So let's jump in the pilot seat. Let's get cracking. Right, so down here to the bottom right. No, we don't want to do that. And let's get our way over to Neptune. Let's see what's lurking for us. Hopefully we can close this one out today. Wait, do you see that? There's a ship just drifting out there. No time to take in the sights. That could be our vanguard. Something's wrong. The ship's weapons are powering up. Get ready! Right, we definitely need Come to... Come in. If you stop shooting at us, we'd be more than happy to respond. It's not me. Marks hijacked my ship. Why find a couple of them, but they'd lock me down. Really could use an assist. You blow that ship out of the stars, he's dead and our artifact's gone. We're going to have to board. Target the engines. Once they stall out, we'll have our chance. Right, so target the engines. Is there a specific way we need to do that? Because I feel like I'm just going to blow this ship to smithereens if I just keep shooting it. So. We're just going to keep firing away. asteroids we're taking a bit of a hit ourselves actually I'm just gonna keep using the lasers you know what would one missile do just out of curiosity Right, so, most hostile ships can be boarded once the ship's engines are down. You must fly, fly close to the ship before you will be allowed to dock. Once you board, expect the crew on the ship to fight That's back. That's it. Start the docking routine. Come on. Let's oh, go rescue that vanguard. Press D. I've pressed the wrong button. We're floating in space. I think we are literally parked on top of the ship, though. Here we go. Let's dock on it. Stabilize. Stay on target. That was a pleasant change of scenery. Right. So we've ended up. Well, who's that? 
Have we just ended up in the middle of the ship? Well. Bam. Sit down. Boom. Oh no. Press pressing all the wrong buttons today. Not helping myself here. Uh, a mirrored um ecalyptic spaceship, we'll take that, we'll take the med kit. Some sparkling water, spaceship workshop. Oh, it's gonna be a loot party today. Some red wine, utility headphones, sounds funky. Oh. Thank you, Sarah. Suppress Grendel. Right, what we do need to do, and I didn't do it at the end of the last episode. But I did mention that I needed to change where my gun bash was. It's just not working in the place that it is, basically. So, um, I need to rebutton that at some point. I'm just having a little nose around just in case we missed anything important here. I don't know if our instrumentation is rated for long term exposure to this level of cold. Right, okay, so. What are you saying? It's extra cold round here, or can we sleep? Oh, nice little, nice little trick there, isn't it? Always get a little sleeping where you can. Heals you up. Free of charge. Uh, sober, yeah, we'll take all this stuff. I wonder if we can actually um, come away with. Maybe with this ship, actually, to be fair. As well, I suppose it's what condition is Moira in. So, let's go find out. Well, he don't look too good. There's a jump seat here. Right, okay, so... Am I glad to meet whoever you two are? Looks like we're all in one piece. Any day you walk away from, right? We're from the Explorers Group, Constellation. We need to talk. What? You guys still exist? Man, I've only heard stories. We've heard stories too. About a strange object you found on patrol. So, you know what that thing is? I tried to hawk it in Sidonia, and the guy thought I was peddling phony titanium. Mm, it doesn't play nice with scanners. It'd be worthless to someone trying to flip rare minerals quickly. So you're saying I shouldn't be using it as a hood ornament? It'll be better in our hands. Hey, I'll trade some weird space rock for a rescue anytime. Hope you figure out whatever that thing is. Let's grab the artifact. Boom. Well, that's mine. Good work. Let's get back to the lodge. Roger, Roger. Can we not uh, just take the ship? Mm, clearly not. Right, so we need to head back. Let's just quickly, before I do forget, bindings, melee. So. Let's shift that around a bit. I think that'll work better for me. Alright, let's get this crate into space. Okie dokie. Right, so now it wants us to head back to the lodge. 
I think we'll be able to finish this mission up. Finally. And then it'll be time to see what happens next, I guess. So it's whether we want to stick with some of the Constellation missions. Or do we want to go off and explore on our own? And it's a big old world. Grab jump. There we go. Let's pump it. Fasten your seatbelts, boys and girls. We're going on a long drive. Roger. Scan complete. You are cleared to land at New Atlantis. Please. Right, oh, so I think. Can we just literally land and fast travel straight to the lodge from this map? I think we can, if I remember rightly. So that should hopefully cut out a little bit of time there. And then we can see. Um, See where we go from there, really. Yeah, so we're straight here at the lodge. In New Atlantis. Uh, we've got to go see Kelton as well, actually. So, it could be worth doing. The scientist of the tree. The tree uh, fanatic. I hope you are satisfied with the quarters <laughs> available to you. Go ahead. I haven't even looked at them yet, Basco, to be honest. It fits. Boom. Spiked a bit, but it's restabilized. Is there anything new showing up? No, it's the same as before. There's a massive output as the artifact is added, then it harmonizes. Like it's waiting for the others. Hmm, that's speculation, but I think you're right. We need more. Here. You've earned this. Welcome to Constellation. As a full member this time. Woohoo! Uh it's an honor to be part of this. We're going to do great things together. All of us. By the way, how would you like to keep traveling together? I'm not sitting behind my desk for this. These artifacts are a new chapter for Constellation, and I'm going to be out there for it. And I want you out there as well. You got results. <laughs> I need someone like you watching my back. Uh, you know, I'm flattered. And quite clearly she comes with some skills as well, doesn't she? So astrodynamics, lasers, leadership, botany. Um, but to be honest, I don't think I want Sarah as my companion right now. So I'm just going to say I work better alone, Sarah. <laughs> so that's what it feels like. This is 20 years of karma coming back to me. Fine, but I'm not wasting you. Let's talk about more artifacts. First, there's an expedition that Sam Co has been putting together. It's in Free Star Collective Space, and he knows it inside and out. Mm -hmm. There's also the Eye, our star station in orbit. About time for you to meet Vladimir. He's been hard at work tracking down more anomalies. And last but not least, Noel. Have we heard anything from Barrett yet? A courier from Argos Extractors came by to let us know they're packing up the operation on Vectera. But that's it. No other word. Mm, that's not good. We should get over there and check on Barrett in person. Finishing the old neighborhood uh, mission. I think that was just saying it allows us to recruit Sarah as a companion. So we've got a few stuff that we can do. Um, so... Well, let's just go. So what should I do first? It's all important, but if you want a direction, I'd grab Barrett first. He's not just an old friend. He's been all over the settled systems. Uh, hello? Well, well let's what leave it there then, Sarah. And... I cannot wait to meet him. Right, we've got a it's mission as well over there. Someone to speak to. I think... Can we have Vasco follow us as well? This is felt like home. Captain, now that you are a member of Constellation, Boom. I am at your service. 
no additional protocols necessary. Also, given the likelihood that you will be out in unsettled space, it might be beneficial to go over exploration outpost development in case you ever need to build a base for field research. Yeah, that sounds good. But first of all, uh, Vasco, um, let's Captain get on the crew. Jimmy, I will proceed to my assigned <laughs> post. Captain Jimmy, manage your crew, review and change their assignments between your ships and outposts. Different crew have different skills which enhance your ship or outposts. Right, okay, so we're going to assign Vasco. Right, and do we need to assign... Can we put Sarah on the ship as well? So we can put Sarah on the ship, but I'm just going to go with Vasco for now. Because I think we're going to go and see if we can get Barrett first. Um, that's the lodge key. That, well, that takes us to New Atlantis. Trying to figure out where our room is. If I think is it down? It's not this one. I think we're in this one here, aren't we? Chrono Mark watch case. It all sounds good to me. So we have got storage here as well. So I think I can if I need to. Moby Dick. Classic. So I think, yeah, if I need to, I can uh, store a bit of stuff in here. I don't think I'm carrying anything uh, particularly that we need to. I think I'll probably need to switch over to that, to be honest. That is... Uh, slightly different perks on it but it's got a 4% chance to reflect damage and I think on the basis of that I think the rest of the stuff is either to be sold or we can just put on the ship for now so we'll go to mission select and although I am quite tempted to go and seek out the dream home actually so maybe that's something that we'll do I think first we'll go pick Barrett up there let's get Barrett back into the team we can utilize him on the crew and we can go see uh, our old friends back on Vectara We have got some shops and stuff as well over here. Um, that could come in handy at some point. But let's um, ship over to the surface map and just travel straight over next to the ship. We'll sell some stuff off, get rid of that, and then we'll head over to to see Barrett. Got anything you need to offload? Uh, ah, and I can sell directly from Frontier as well, so we can get rid of some of this stuff that we've got. We don't need that. I'm not looking at keeping that. I don't need that either. Pack wise, I don't think there's any point in keeping all this stuff. I might keep the Constellation pack just because that's like, you know, our first one. Uh, any weapons that we're not really utilizing so there's a bashing modified equinox I probably need to swap some of these around as well the kraken which I don't even think we've used yet uh, we've got suppress Grendel right okay so we have got a few stuff here all there we just want to make some money Uh, helmet wise we'll keep the constellation again we'll get rid of all these uh, do we want to keep a cap no we don't do you want the headphones no we don't miscellaneous 
I'm not really sure what I do with any of this stuff. I don't want a pill bottle. Uh, wire spool can go. We'll get rid of the bubble level on that. So yeah, I think we've just got rid of quite a bit of stuff. I've still got a lot of weapons. I just want to sort those out as well. So let's get down into the inventory. Weapon wise. And we want to change you over. We've got to keep the cutter. Can't get rid of that. So we've got a modified or suppressed. I'm going to keep the suppressed and get rid of the other two so we can sell those off we've got a side star and a kraken so i want to keep that we'll keep this and get rid of the other and again that'll just free up a little bit more space right. so you know how important it is to um yeah to have at least a bit of mass that you can pick up as much loot as possible and you'll be getting used to how much I uh, enjoy picking up loot and we're getting rid of that, that, rescue axe and we'll keep the other stuff because we don't have another of it and I'm still testing out some of these but I am really enjoying the shotgun um, I don't think I've got any, oh I've got some skill points so we have ranked this up so I have managed to do the um, the task at hand. And again, I think we're going to stick the shotguns for a bit. So why not rank that up? And now we need to kill 50 enemies with a shotgun. And then we've got another point as well. So we're going down the shotgun route there. Science, we've got the astrodynamics. We've got quite a bit in tech. We've still got quite a bit to do around that. And then we've got physical. We've got nothing in social. And would it be worth going for commerce? Because at the end of the day, we have been employed all our life up until now, where we've been cast out and had to start thinking for ourselves because of unique situations that have happened. But with that, we probably would have picked up a bit of knowledge about how to run business. Um, we've got a few entrepreneurial skills, I guess, which could come in handy if we set this off quite early too. It means that every time we're selling things, we're getting 10% more. 10% is a big amount, especially you know if it's a thousand credits, we're getting a hundred credits every every single sale on that. And the more money we've got, the better ships that we can invest in. I think that's a great way to go forward. I'm going for it. And it spreads out our skills as well. So we've got physical, social, combat, science, and quite a bit in tech. Right, and with that, let's head back onto the ship. There's our buddy Vasco. Now we'll get back into the cockpit, the pilot seat, the captain's chair, the throne of the starship. We're going to leave it there for today. Thank you very much for watching. Please don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. What we'll do is in the next episode, we will go and see our friends on Vectara. And let's see where that mission takes us. Ciao for now.